Hi, in this tutorial movie, I'm going to show you how to edit XML file with XML Writer. As you know, in the previous tutorial movies, I have already shown you how we can um, edit the XML data file for ED quiz and ED top for IBT using uh, WinWord, uh, Word 2003 and Word 2007. And also, um, we can uh, edit XML data file using WordPad, Notepad, um, any uh, text editing programs. However, um, to make the full benefits of um, XML data file, I strongly advise you to edit this file with okay, a more um, advanced tool called XML Writer so when you right click on the file and if you have already installed XML Writer in the drop down menu there should be okay, a place called edit with XML Writer and you click now this is what you see um, there are some big differences if you uh, have already done the editing in WinWord or in other uh, text editing program. First, the XML data structures are organized uh, quite neatly, uh, very well structured as you see here. And also, uh, there are different colors. The Normally, the default color is black for data and purple color for the XML tags. The attributes is marked at red and the value is normally in uh, blue. Um, if you look at the panels here, there are quite a lot of tools, but uh, for editing the XML data file for ED top 4 IBT, uh, there are only okay, several tools that you normally use. Um, the first one that I think you will use very often is this one, uh, the check if well form, or you can use the shortcut F6. So when you click here, okay, the system will check um, if this file is well formed. And as you see the message here, it says the document is well formed. Now, why is it important? Uh, when you edit this file, um, possibly okay, uh, there will be mistakes. Uh, you may forget to close a tag, or you may, um, by mistake, uh, delete uh, a certain tag. So, um, when you click on Check It Well Form, the system will show you uh, where uh, the problem is and it say you okay, a lot of time when you work on a very big file uh, like this for example here uh, let's see I just by mistake delete this uh, tag so uh, there should be an error here okay the tag is open but it is not closed so if I uh, If I pull it up and I click on okay, check it well form, and this time the error message comes up. It says the end tag glossary does not match with the tag item. So it say basically it said okay, this is not the closing tag for this. So I can infer from the message that something is missing here, and I should. Okay, and the item like this. All right. So, uh, check it well form is used quite frequently to okay identify problems or errors in the file. Now, um, suppose that you edit the file with uh, WinWord. When you open the XML data file in WinWord, this is what you see. Um, 
Now one problem is that uh, when I um, edit some things in the XML data file in WinWorks, um, and save it. Okay, this is the troubles. Now, when an XML data file is edited in WinWork, okay, the XML structures will be okay broken. And if I uh, view this as um, and basically, okay, you see, it is not structured into tag. Uh, it's just a very long line of text and if you open the file with WordPad or Notepad you will see the same problem um, now if I grab the text and you will see okay, it will be like this and obviously it's very hard to troubleshoot so in this case, XML uh, writer will be a great help. You open it and then find a button called Auto Format Text. This one. Click on it and it says a new document will be created with the text Auto Format. I click on OK and you see here, voila, everything is reorganized neatly and uh, very tidily like this okay so again there will be two functions of XML writer that you use most stuffing the auto format tag okay, to okay, restructure the file and the track it will form okay, to Okay, look for errors on the bugs in the file. Now, when I have already reformatted the file, I just need to save it and basically I will just uh, save on the data file that has the error. Now, if I open the file again, with WordPad, you will see okay, it is very well organized again. Okay, so uh, XM Writer is uh, really a very good tool for number one, reformatting the XML data file, and number two, for uh you know debugging the XML file.